the boat, the, the hiking straps are basically lying on the floor of the yeah. boat. And one of the problems with these boats and most of the boats is that the, the, the uh, load point on the front of the hiking strap is too far back compared to the other end. So when you hike, you tend to get pushed aft. Because you, you have normally you have a piece of a shock cord here, so here we have a piece of of uh, rope spectra, mm -hmm. which holds it there. So when I hike, I don't get pushed aft. Mm -hmm. And then I put this heavy duty shock cord on the back mm -hmm. to keep things up in the air. So when you tack, you just have to make sure you get your foot over the other side, and then you can't miss. Mm -hmm. you, know, you don't have to look for the mm -hmm. the hiking what I did here was, well, this is my, I have two, two rescue systems on this. When you capsize, you either capsize the lured or you capsize the windward. If you capsize to, to, to windward, then you're in the water here, but you need to get a hiking line over the other side. So you, this rope you take and you throw across the other side of the boat. And this one actually has a loop where you can put your foot in, Step, yeah. so you can get back into the boat. Yeah. But if the boat capsizes the leeward, then this is a long way away when the boat's on its side. Mm -hmm. So here we have the uh, traveler line, which mm -hmm. goes through this shackle that I put on on there, so that when you're when you're out on the on the you can go out on, on the center board and you have to have the double loop like this because if you only have this rope, you keep falling off the back of the center board. Mm -hmm. Which is not good. Mm -hmm. This way it's long enough you can stand on the the, the other mm -hmm. board the lower and lean back mm -hmm. and pull the boat up. And that's part of the traveler line. What's the traveler line? Because so it's continuous traveler all the way around. Yeah, it's a con it's a continuous traveler line. It's just that it's it's the most obvious control to use to make a mm -hmm. a rescue line. Mm -hmm. The the boom bank because this was a Johnson that used to have twelve to one under the deck, mm -hmm. but the loads were so high that it was starting to to break the bottom of the mast. So uh, it's a year because now. Only a quarter of the load is going into the boat, and three quarters of the load is on this end, on this mm -hmm. bale which I added to the mast. Mm -hmm. So I'm still using the same shackle and an eye strap, mm -hmm. but I in, decrease the amount of load on the base of the mast. So you've got one of the um, blocks on a fixed shackle. Yeah, because on on the Melgas boats, this hole is farther aft, yes. so this is on the this block would be on, on the, the bale, bale and, right. but it's it's too far aft if you do it on this. But mm -hmm. if you don't, you just put it on. You know, you mm -hmm. put a bale on, which takes most of the load, mm -hmm. and and it's in a better position. Mm -hmm. uh, and then I had to re re run the lines underneath the deck to to get it back to sixteen to one, which is what the class limit is. Right. Oh yeah, the well, the finished bag is. Yeah. So the mesh bag is 12 inches square, big enough for all your water bottles and stuff like that. And it's bungeed on this front corner. Yeah, actually, there's a bungee on the other corner, too. Now. Okay. But it, it, it's going to more or less stay. And it's got a pocket for your radio in front here. Yeah. Velcro. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A two to one on here. Mm -hmm. So then now I've got a two to one on the board up, which easier makes it a lot easier. Yeah, this will be the big one. And I replaced the. Normally these boats come with the quarter inch bungee, mm -hmm. but I put. Well, they will. I think this is five sixteenths. A little stronger. Yes, yeah, it's a little stronger. And these, the the Johnson boats run the, the shock cord from the this board down line, which is this thing, mm -hmm. to this, to the back of the boat, and then it goes all the way up to the bulkhead. Same thing. Rather than around the, whereas the, the, the Melgas boat just goes across. Right. So you've got a much longer piece of, of shock cord, which means you can have a lot more tension on it, but it doesn't. It'll, the tension stays more or less constant as the board goes up.
Yes. So th this Less is change. This has a lot of I've ever put said. a lot of tension on. That's fantastic. Yeah. So yeah, this 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 can just sit in there. Right. Yeah. When you need it, and you've got your lifting bridle with uh, little yeah, the, uh, S hooks. Yeah, well, they have a quarter inch like Cunningham hooks, which are rated yeah. 450 uh, pounds, which is November, each. Right. each. Right. So, one of them should be able skip, to lift the whole boat. The, uh, the class allows you to have a five inch hole the in the transom. Mm -hmm. So, this allows you to, you when you're yourself, traveling, you can slide the boom out. Oh, that's And nice. then just slide it into the bottom of the boat. Oh, I have, that's I have nice. pads that I put on both ends of the, of the boom. So I, I only did this on one side because you only need you to need store the boom once. once but. So I got sick of it. I got sick of it. And wow. I wanted, so and I never sell and that's, and that's, that's enough tape to. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, what you needed well, to do. Actually, you can put the boat in the water. Looks like me. Without yeah. anything on here at all. I, I, I never just take in. It'll well so without the, the plastic you could. Thought, You'd probably get a, a cup of water in the boat, but once so you're sailing, this isn't water in the water. So. Yeah. But, but what this does is that if you <laughs> do swamp the boat, then what you do is you tear the, the tape off completely, right. so it won't, won't reseal. And then yeah. when you, if you, if you get some of the water in and then you stop, right. which happens a lot, then it just, it it just flows in. Okay. Oh, that's really nice. They're all six, two or three, all 220. Awesome.